Hello, I'm Richard Larrington and this is Larrington Trailers. Uh, we're here because we're doing the launch of our new hire trailers. And uh, in front of you, what you can actually see is our uh, harvester model in black. And uh, I'm going to spend a few moments just taking you around this trailer and letting you have a look at the quality of trailer that we've built and why we've made it the way we have. Firstly, let's just have a look at the back of the tractor. What we've done with the higher group of trailers that we're going to do is we're going to provide a mud flat system for the back of the tractor. This is a really important piece because we want to stop those stones thrown up to the front of the trailer. I'm trying to safeguard the trailer, but also when you've got produce in the trailer, the last thing you actually need is that mud and stone going right over the top and hitting your produce. You don't need that. So this fastens to the three point linkage. It's a simple system, good mud flaps, nice length, and it's protecting the whole thing. And I think that's the sort of thing you should supply on every trailer. And when you hire a trailer for muds, you're going to get one of those with that higher deal. So as you're protecting the trailer, protecting the tractor and keeping it all in there. Now, let's just have a look at the trailer itself. The Harvester trailer is a half pipe trailer. It is 24 feet long, this one is. It is uh, uh, an 18 ton carrying ability trailer. We've made it with four foot six sides, so it's low enough to work with potatoes, but it's high enough to get a good wheat load in it as well. Um, the, our, our normal standard chassis is uh, a 300 by 100 by uh, uh, 8 mil thick uh, beam. And uh, we've done some special things with this trailer because all of our high trailers are going to come with the important thing was a hydraulic rollover sheet on. This is the future of transportation for farming that you can very quickly and simply put the sheet on and take the sheet off when you've got the load. It's a little bit special on this one because we've, the hydraulic rollover can be positioned wherever it wants to be positioned and uh, we, we are going to use it with, uh, in this case it's going to be used with a, a lightweight product but it's going to stop wind draft as well. So we're going to position the rollover sheet so it can only be halfway or all the way and see if we can get all the product we want into the, into the trailer. I'm now going to ask the driver to actually start the tractor and we're going to watch this rollover sheet go over and we're going to do it from two or three positions so you can see the accuracy and control that he's actually got while he's using the rollover sheet. Okay. Here goes. And the most important thing is that when the rollover sheets come over, the bar on the far side now tucks itself underneath the big pole. And that means that there's nothing going to lodge on the rollover sheet from the inside. If we could ask you to tip slightly the trailer. And now open the tail door. Let's go to the back of the trailer and watch it working from the rear. If we look inside here as well in the trailer, see how smooth that is. This is three sheets, a floor sheet, two side sheets. When potatoes or anything come out of this trailer, there is no cross welds in here that's going to take the outside of the potatoes off to skin the potatoes. So that's really smooth, really accurate and very, very clean and tidy. Okay, so we're going to ask him to roll that sheet back over again while the tail door's open. That's it. Okay, that's great. Now, do it again backwards. That gives you really isn't that simple. And a bit more. Stop there. Now look, what we're trying to do, an elevator now can go in the side in the opening here. And this sheet hopefully will be able to stop some of the wind draft coming in from that far side because it's a light product so it can be used like that and we'll see how well we get on in the in the uh, future with, with with the trials okay let's have that sheet back okay now he's going to bring his tail door down all the way and it locks in on here, that's it locked, 
let the body down, job done. So this is how we intend to do all of our hire trailers. It's a clean, tidy, very strong 18 ton trailer. It's got a really, really good uh, capacity. It's got a simple to use. And I think that the law is going to get us. So when we take things down the road in the future, we, don't, we can't have anything poking above the side of the trailer. And the only way of reducing that is by having the rollover sheet. So this is the way we're going to market it. It's the way we're going to hire it with the uh, rear mud guards for the tractor. And so if you've enjoyed that, give us a shout when you're next ready to hire your trailers. Let us know because you can have one of these on your farm as well. So thank you for looking at this video. I hope you've enjoyed it.